Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Sammy Ketchum, and welcome back to Sammy Ketchum TCG. Today, we are going to be taking a look at Zero or VMAX on PTCG Live. That's right, Zero or VMAX on PTCG Live. Now, um, PTCG Live is um, the new Pokemon trading card game online system that they came out with um, during the Fusion Strike set. All right. Um, it was actually supposed to launch then, but they've been in a state of beta ever since. But now PTCG Live has gone global. They're doing a global beta. And hopefully that will, you know, lead to basically, that will lead to the game getting better online. That will lead to the game getting better online, better features, better gameplay, etc., everything. So, but it's still in beta. But even while it's still in beta, we are actually we're gonna, um, we're going to be taking a look at that and we're going to be, um, Featuring Zero or VMAX today. All right. And when we come back, we're gonna take a look at the deck and do some and do some gameplay battles. All right, guys, we are back, and here it is, ladies and gentlemen. This is Zero or VMAX. All right, we're gonna talk about this deck a little bit here. I guess a little deck profile to show you. All right. <laughs> Zero or VMAX. <laughs> he has 320 HP. It's an electric Pokemon. <laughs> kind of like a pseudo legendary here. <laughs> All right. It has two attacks. The first attack, reactive pulse for two electric energies. All right. This attack does 60 damage for each of your opponent's Pokemon in play that has an ability. This attack is absolutely broken. Absolutely broken. This attack is amazing. And it's basically the attack we're really going to focus on in this deck because... Um, a lot of Pokemon that we use in our games, they all have abilities. All of them. Lugia V-Star has an ability. Berbero has an ability. Crobat, Luminion, the Archeops, they all have abilities. Um, Mew VMAX, the whole deck. Um, all of the... Uh, all of the Pokemon on the bench... They all have abilities. You know, every Pokemon that you want to use to help you search, to help you draw, they all have abilities. This format will get eaten alive by Zero or VMAX's Reactive Pulse right now. And nobody is looking at it. This thing is a freaking beast. All right? Now, <laughs> that's just this attack. The next attack, Max Fist, um, two lightning and a colorless, does 240 damage. But you discard two energy from this Pokemon. All right. So we can use that, you know, um, with a choice belt that's 270. Um, if you play like a Zigzagoon or something, you can hit 280 if you really wanted to. You know, but, but we're really not you know, too worried about that. 240 is pretty decent, you know. But that first attack, my God. My God. Oh, my gosh. I, I think I really have something here. And there's two copies of those. Um, also in this deck, we have one copy of the Zero or V-Star. Um, 270 HP, all right. It's for, um, is well, only attack, really, is Crushing Beat for 190. Two Lightning and a Colorless. 
And just like Lugia V-Star, you may discard a stadium in play. All right. So that's really good. Um, it's decent. But the one thing we really love about Zero Aura V-Star is this V-Star ability attack. Lightning Storm Star. Three colorless. I mean, <laughs> not three colorless. Three lightning <laughs> and one colorless. All right, choose one of your opponent's Pokemon four times. You could choose you could choose the same Pokemon more than once, or you could choose four different Pokemon. All right, for each time you choose a Pokemon, you do 60 damage to it. This damage is not affected by weakness or resistance. You can't add more than one V-Star ability per game, of course. You know. So, um, but, but what you do with this is that it's like you're sniping, you're sniping damage. So you can go 60 here, 60 here, 60 here, 60 here, you know, um, lost box decks, all the comfies. You could just basically just snipe all the comfies off the field. All right. You could put, um, 60 on the active and then another 60 more on the active, or you could do. 120 to the 120 to one Pokemon and then do the other one on 260 somewhere else. I, I absolutely love this as like a little surprise, you know, as like a little surprise factor coming in. Just just doing that, taking like two, three prizes at a time is amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. And if they're not ready for it, they're gonna get rocked. <laughs> also to note, Zero Aura V-Star has free retreat. So this is also a really good thing if you just like want to evolve it, like just to get out of the active spot and to have like a free floater on the field. This this could be it right here. This is your free floater. You know? Bring him in, bring him out of the active, bring up somebody else to attack. This is very, very good. <laughs> And I love this Lightning Storm Star V-Star attack. <laughs> okay. Um, got some Zero Aura V in here. All right. Really, we're just using it to evolve into the uh, V-Max and V-Star. All right. Um, I have three copies of these. All right. Um, one copy of this one. The Zero Aura V um, with the cross fists. All right. Let's see. Um, another Pokemon um, noteworthy of talking about is Flaffy. All right. Flaffy is one of my favorite Pokemon. Well, evolves into my favorite Pokemon, Ampharos. <laughs> All right. It has the ability Dynamotor. Once during your turn, you may attach an electric energy card from your discard pile to one of your bench Pokemon. So, the goal of the deck is basically to discard your lightning energies or your electric energies. Get them back with Flaffy, attach them to your Zero Auras, and then you send them out to battle. Alright? Um, this also works well with Zero Aura's second attack, the, the VMAX, when you have to discard your energies. All right, you discard your energies, you can get them back on the field with Flaffy and reattach them to either the VMAX or the V-Star or what have you or something on the bench, which is very, very good. Um, Flaffy is especially a great engine with the V-Star, especially if you have it on the bench or have like a Zero or a V on the bench and then you attach like the energies with Flaffy to it on the bench and then evolve it to the V-Star. Pow, there you go. All right, we also have ourselves one copy of the Manaphy in here. It's very good um, when you're trying, when you want to protect your Flaffies on the bench. If you're going into a match and you know you're facing somebody who's going to be spreading to the bench, this will be very good to have on the bench with the wave availability. Okay. Um, one copy of Luminion V. All right, search for support in your deck. All right, one copy of Crobat V. All right, 
All right, so let's see. You've got some battle VIP passes. Of course, you know, they're at four. Got some evolution incenses. All right. Got ourselves a lost vacuum. <laughs> you want to remove, if you want to remove a stadium or a tool cart, you know, this could be very useful. You know, um, four quick balls, of course. Um, three ultra balls. All right. Got two at a Temple of Sinnoh. Now, with this deck, I actually had a number of stadiums I could have stuck in here. I could have went with um, Training Court. Training Court also would have been a great stadium for this deck to get like, back an energy from the discard pile since I, I'm discarding energies with, you know, that second attack or or just, you know, just by chance, like ultra balling him or quick balling him away for Flaffy to get them on the field. I could have went with um, Training Court. I also could have went with, um, I also could have went with um, Stormy Mountains that lets me search out an electric or dragon type basic Pokemon, you know, but I've got so much basic search in this deck, you know, I don't, I don't think I need, I don't think I needed that, but Temple of Sinnoh, I think is very good, especially against like Lugia VMAX, um, Temple of Sinnoh is also good against Regigigas, things like that, I'm, you know, I'm thinking about the format, would it may actually play against and like bigger competitions things like that um temple of Sinnoh, all special entities attached to a pokemon both yours and your opponents provide colorless energy and have no other effect so it shuts off all of their special energies um this is this would be very very good against like decks like lugia because like they they um their special energy rely on their effects and if they can't get rid of it fast enough they can't do what they really want to do. Now, don't get me wrong. Lugia can remove the stadium after the fact, you know. But if you get it off, if you get this off at the right time, then, you know, they're, um, for the moment, they're, um, their special energies become useless, which is really good. All right. Um, let's see. Do, do, do. One copy of Boss's Orders. All right. Got some Marnies up in here. All right. Got some Junipers up in here. <laughs> More Wifey Bay. <laughs> All right. Got some Roxanne. Mm, who doesn't love some Roxanne? <laughs> All right. And we got the Bay Girl Serena. <laughs> yep. Love me, love me some Serena, man. Three copies of this Bay. <laughs> All right. Got some air balloons, so we can retreat some of our Pokemon. I mean, we're just not going to rely on Zero or V-Star. You know, we got to have some retreating options in this deck. All right, two copies of Choice Belt. All right, some Speed Lightning Energy, so you can, like, draw cards while you attach energy, which is very good. And, um, and ten, um, Lightning Energies. Ten Lightning Energies. Or electric energies, or whatever you want to call them. <laughs> All right, so that is zero or Vmax. Let's go jump into some gameplay. Um, I really do like a PTCG live though. For for kind of like a casual competitive person like me, I, I think it's really really good. Hehe. <laughs> Oh my god, the funny avatars. Ah, <laughs> uh, tails. The zero or coin is hype. Let's go. I think I'm going to go second. Yeah, I'm going to go second. All right. Now, I could have chose to go first, which would have been very, very good for me. But okay, I got a mulligan. But one of the reasons why I don't want to go first is because Zero or VMAX's first attack relies on your opponent having abilities. 
and most of the time your opponent's abilities won't really go off until like their second turn like when they evolve into the pokemon when they get going when they start bringing out their attackers that's when all of their abilities would start to go off oh and <laughs> they got a crowbat start <laughs> okay so let's see what they got going on here oh wow never mind <laughs> gosh <laughs> Those PTCG live hands are no joke. <laughs> oh my god. I love that. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Very nice though. I don't know how she got these outfits though. Cool though. Alright. Um. Okay. <laughs> we take those. We take those. Something popped off. Let's go. <laughs> it really wasn't a game, but um, the reason why I wanted to go second is because all their abilities will pop off. And if all their abilities pop off and they get all the Pokemon with abilities in play, Zero or VMAX first attack will, um, will, will just go to town on them. We'll just go to town on them. And I'm setting him. I'm setting them up for that. Huh. Let's go. Okay. Good. I get to. Um. I get to. I get to show you guys this. So. Let's go. Okay. Sorry. Let's see what my opponent's got. Huh. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> bleep, bleep. <laughs> Oh, really? Lunatone Soul Rock? <laughs> oh, God. Well, looks like Zero V Star is going to have a good time. <laughs> that V Star Billy is going to be sick. Oh. Oh, God. Huh. I guess they think they could farm wins by playing... No, it's Shadow Rider. Ha! It's Shadow Rider Lunatone. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm going to rock this deck. <laughs> like, almost all the Pokemon are going to have abilities except for this guy. Like, I, I, I really can't wait. Okay, my turn. Okay. So, all right. So let's see, we're going to go Quick Ball, discarding the Serena. I mean, it's basically a boss. You always want to want to do that. We're going to get the Crobat. All right, those are the basics. Let's see, all. All right, so we've got that in there. We've got both our VMAX and our V Stars in here. Okay. All right. We're good. We're good. We're good. Hmm, kind of don't want this knocked out, but it's all right. I don't think it'll get knocked out, but we'll see. Quick of the balls. We're going to get a Zero Aura. Zero Aura V. Pinch this bad boy. Ah, there we go. Okay, cool. Dark ass. Okay. Nice. So, let's attach an energy to... I would say that. Let's see. Hold on. Quick ball. 
Maybe that's what you're gonna discard one of these. And we're gonna get um this. I kick it. Hmm. Yeah, bench this. Hmm. I could go get Luminion and then Martin. Because I kind of want to keep this. Actually, let's do... Hmm. I kind of want to keep that. I could get rid of it, though. Hmm. Hmm. Let's do that. I'm going to get the Luminion. Let me see something. Actually, I could have gotten rid of it. Yeah, I could have gotten rid of it. Yeah, because I have two in a deck. Okay, yeah, I could have gotten rid of it. It's all right, though. I think I want a Marnie anyway. Hmm. Yeah, I want a Marnie anyway. I want to Marnie my opponent. Hmm. Huh. I only have one Marnie in the deck anyway. <laughs> ah, I have the air balloon. <laughs> So it doesn't matter. Well, I still want to retreat it. Get the energy in the discard pile. I think I'm going to save the rest of this. In turn. Huh. I did kind of... <laughs> Mess myself up there. I don't have like a supporter or anything like to evolve my Pokemon next turn, but I think we'll be okay. 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 Uh, yeah, I probably should have. Uh, yeah, I should have researched. I really should have researched. But, you know, it's all right. It is all right. Let's see what they got. <laughs> okay. What? <laughs> oh my God. Wow, did I seriously Marnie him into anything? I mean, I don't have anything to do either. <laughs> so I'm just gonna pass. <laughs> Oh God, I was like, no, you pass? Okay, I pass. <laughs> you got something? <laughs> nope, not a. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm running us both into bad hands. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> not sorry. Oh, God. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh. Oh, my God. <laughs> you gave me the win? Dude. That was... <laughs> All you had to do was stick it out. Just stick it out. <laughs> and, like, we were both bricking. <laughs> We were both freaking off my party. <laughs> oh. oh. Oh, okay. Oh, man. Okay. <laughs> One more. <laughs> I haven't really gotten to play the game yet. I haven't even brought out Zero or VMAX yet. <laughs> Oh. 
cherry baked bread. Okay. Oh. oh. Gosh darn that Marnie. <laughs> Gosh darn. <laughs> Oh, okay. I'm not going to curse. Mm. It's a strategy. It's a method to my madness. Normally, I would. Oh, okay. This is bad. <laughs> no, my curl bat. Don't worry. I got another one. <laughs> I do not want to research this hand really because... Uh... playing against a lost box deck <laughs> wow this is literally my first lost box deck that i faced on here oh wow a total pass what to do okay so um let's see first i'm gonna battle vip pass let's go let's get a zero aura and this I'm going to actually do this so I can look at what's in here. I've got two Flappies in here so I can discard that. I've got a Zero Aura v, v Max in here. So the other one is Prize. So yeah, I really do need to um, keep that, um, that, that V Star. I only need to keep that V Star. Yeah, I need to keep that V Star. Okay. Yeah, I need to keep that V-Star. So what we're going to do... I need to keep this, so... What we're going to do is we're going to go for the Minion. And then we're going to go the Minion. Oh, come on. There we go. All right. Yes. All right. Go for the Marnie. <laughs> Marnie again. Oh, God. Here we go, Marnie. Oh, God. Please don't run me into a dead end. Oh, God. Oh, okay. Oh, busted. Battle VIP pass. Okay. But I get no energy, so it's all right. It's quite all right. Gonna get another one of these and another zero aura. And then we're going to pass. Okay. There's a comfy. So ability one. Scoop up net that. Battle VIP pass. Mm. Oh, they put a man of V down. Yo. Oh, they're respecting my V star. <laughs> oh, they morning me. Okay, we can knock up the, um, we can knock this out though. I still have my boss in my deck somewhere. Okay, so. Let's go this. We have Pokemon with two abilities, so I'm doing like 120 damage. Hmm, let's see what we got here. We don't have energies in there, so. I think I'm gonna get this. Okay. Um, attach energy here. Evolve this. Then we're gonna go. Serena. I can only draw cards because they have no V Pokemon. That is fine. 
and we have ourselves this, which is fine. And then we're going to do some dynamotoring. All right. All right, come on, MG. There we go. All right. Tornado. They don't really snipe. They really use this to damage counters. There's no way to like, there's no way to like block that. Let's see what they got going. Right now I'm doing 120 damage with this. That's actually really just good enough for this, so. So at some point I need to boss this. So my V-Star can just go kick their butts. <laughs> it's four in here. Where's this Sableye? Oh, it's coming right now. <laughs> oh, that's not Sableye. Okay, sure, sure, sure. Scoop up net, of course. Flower selecting, of course. <laughs> oh my god, it's so cool seeing like their cars just like float into this thing. Oh, there's the cramorant. Okay. Okay, you got something to switch out now? Oh, there we go. <laughs> Speak of the devil. Sure. <laughs> oh, another escape rope. Okay. Um, I mean, it really doesn't matter. I mean, you know I'm not going to bring out my attacker and let you attack into it. Like, come on, bruh. Like, who do you think I am? Like, really, who do you think I am? Uh, that could really spell trouble for me. Okay. Oh, Marnie. <laughs> oh, Marnie. <laughs> I really want a boss, though. Um, let's see. Do, do, do. Got that, that, that. I think I can get rid of this. Hmm. Two researches, though? I got another research in my deck. I've got one more Marnie, possibly. More Serena's. Okay, I think I can get rid of this, though. I can get rid of this hand. Okay, cool. Okay, let's go. Treat this. Okay. Double Dynamotor. All right. Ultra Ball. This won't matter. <laughs> Dynamo order again. Obliterate! Hmm. Oh yeah, he's weak. <laughs>
Yeah. But this deck is really good. Um, 6, 12, 18. I'm doing like 180 damage right now with this first attack, which is actually really good against this deck. So, the only thing I maybe have a is maybe this. I wonder, do they have like Charizard or something in here? I know this can snipe, but. Stabilize is really the only thing I'm really worried about right now. I think, you know, not sure about anything else. Okay, flower selecting more. Okay. Ooh, I lost vacuum. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So they lost on another one. Nine, ten. So are they gonna attack a Sableye now? Cause I guess they could knock this out, I guess. Or do, you know, that and maybe something else. Well, I don't think they can knock anything else out, but maybe put damage on somebody. I mean, I'm really not too worried about that. All right. A Fault Crystal for, oh, the Psychic Energy, I think. Yeah. Okay. Sableye. <laughs> Tasha to Sableye. Wait, what? Oh, I guess they can't, like, retreat it. Okay. I mean, that's fine by me. <laughs> that is completely fine by me. I don't even need to, um, do I have any energies in here? I don't think so. Um, we really don't even need to use that, so that's such a touch here. And we're just gonna pulse. Yeah. <laughs> There's a save line. Okay, so I know this is gonna get hit for sure. That's unavoidable. There we go. Yep. Okay. I guess that's another way they're gonna get another two prizes. All right. Hmm. Is there a way that I could get Boss to get that out of play? That's not gonna do too much anything, I don't think. I don't know, it might do something. All right, so let's see. Let's attach this here. Let's go. Oh, I should have quick balled. I should have quick balled and got rid of something. I'm only gonna draw like two cards. Oh, I got the boss. Let's go. Let's go. I think they do play another one, but I don't know if they have another one. Okay. Um, so I did that. All right. I'm going to play this just in case, like, they have, like, a Charter's Art or something. An Aurora Energy. I don't know. So, 
So he can knock this out with save a lot. So he has ten in the dis he has ten in the lost zone. I definitely would not lost zone anything else if I was if I was them. You've got ten in the lost zone. That's really all you need. That's really all you need. I mean, yeah, I mean if you want to search for cards, yeah. But like you're getting rid of stuff that you could possibly use. So like I wouldn't flower select anymore. Unless you just absolutely need to. Like, I don't know what he could be looking for right now. We don't know what they could be looking for right now. Like, you got the Sableye. You got the knockout here on the Crobat. Maybe, maybe a, maybe a Manaphy? Okay. Maybe the Manaphy. Maybe the Manaphy. Yeah. Everything's going here. Of course. Okay. Haha, <laughs> let's go. Images in here. I don't think so. Okay. I want to bench anything. Um, I'm not gonna go. Oh, there's nothing in there. <laughs> okay, never mind. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna put this on a Flaffy. Then we're gonna hit him with this. Roxanne! Okay, so we hit him with the Roxanne. Uh, okay, let's go. Here. We're gonna take care of these sable eyes. Ah. I was gonna hit the comfies, but the sable eyes are really too much trouble. We gotta take care of them right now. Alright, so they've got two cards. I mean, they could flower select. Hopefully they get something. But, let's see. Yeah. Ah! Really? Oh. They literally drew Kiara. Seriously. I think they could get one knockout, but they can't get two. They could get one knockout, but they can't get two. I get the last laugh. I get the last laugh. They could get one knockout on one of my Flaffies, but they don't get a knockout anywhere. So, other than the Flaffy, yeah, you got it. I beat Lost Box. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> oh my god, that's so crazy. All right. Well, guys, that is Zero Aura V Max. All right. <laughs> this deck is pretty busted. 
<laughs> I hope I made some believers out of some people, out of you guys, you know. But um, but yeah, Zero or V Max is really, really a great card. I mean, you get it in it. It comes in its own box along with the V Star. You know, this this card just isn't for show. It's actually really good. This attack reactive pulse is insane. You know, so I hope I, you know, showed that off a little bit today. Anyway, guys, that is the video. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, mischief managed.